Yeah, you can clearly see how that freaking stretches the outer pack. That's fucking fantastic. Come on. Nice, dude. All right, we're good. <laughs> hey guys, one exercise number three. We did mad ass incline exercises. We did a couple of them, you know, off camera, you know, the warm up sets, one or two, uh, you know, working sets. But anyways, kill the upper chest. Did the dips, three sets, man. Three killer sets. Um, you know, for the outer packs. And this is the one I was telling you guys before, man, about the seated chest press. How we turn the bodies and cross over, kind of hit the uh, inner part of our chest. Well, that's what we're gonna do now. And now there's a reason why I do it in these orders, guys. You know, you want to do your bench press, your dumbbells, your barbell, come over to the chest press, and mad weight, and do all kinds of crazy shit, and then try doing dips. Well, if you're anything like me, you're not gonna have success, man, because you're gonna be so fatigued. And uh, dips are so important. My, my routine now, I have to get them in. So I have to do them when I'm fresh. So, you know, well, let's just see what happens. Enough yapping away. Is that we do it, guys? One, one arm at a time. Now, this is our first set, so I mean, I wouldn't call it a warm up set necessarily, but it's not going to be a crazy set. So I can see, I can do five sets, eight sets. 23 sets. I can do as many sets as I want until I feel like I've done enough. You don't have to jump into this shit right away, guys. You know, work your way into, the, into what feels right, you know, weight-wise, you know, number of set-wise. You know, your body will let you know. Uh, you know, if you leave the gym and you feel like really you can, uh, let me see. I'll give you an example. If I can do any push-ups when I'm done with my chest, if I can do one push-up, I haven't worked hard enough, in my opinion. Um, and I mean, that goes for anything. You know, shoulders, or biceps, or... You know, your body, you'll know, I mean, you know, just fucking work hard. You know, your body will let you know when you're done, or when you need more, so... All right, baby, you're up. Good. All right, now we go Rob's turn. I'm gonna try to get at an angle so you can kind of see his body, how it's twisted enough. I can't really see it too well on that angle. There you go, you can kind of see, there you go. Now you can see how his body's twisted here. And this is the part of the chest, right? I'm actually gonna reach out and, and touch his chest. This is the part, look at this. I mean, I could feel his muscle working right there, guys. Okay? Now, Rob, what do you think? How, how does your chest feel so far, bud? Pretty sore already. Nice. You got a uh, you got a pump. You got a chest pump going on. Nice, dude. Now remember, keep your breathing. You know, kind of in check with your. Uh, you know, blow out when you push out, Rob. Blow out, breathe in. Blow out, breathe in. Every rep, if you can, bro. There you go. Right to the other arm. So obviously, you turn into the arm. Yeah, that, that you know that, that's working. There it is. See there, it's just. There you go, bud. So both he and I are taking, uh, not a, I'm not saying a break, but we're not, we're just, our first set, we're sort of, uh, I guess we're taking an easy, yeah, fuck it. There you go, bud. Here we go, working set. That's my camera here. Again, guys, what separates the fucking the badass or some of the fucking vaginas? Check this shit out. Self spot yourself. Get the little foot thing, man. You squat yourself. Do some force reps. Kill that shit. Like we say, every every rep counts. Oh, oh, oh. 
Come on, bud. It's a working set. Come on, baby. There he goes. He's using his foot, man. Come on. I mean, you can have somebody here spotting you, man, but a lot of times when you're by yourself, you got to do it by yourself. You got to do what you got to do. Come on, baby. Keep breathing. Blow out. Breathe in, buddy. Come on. You got to give the, give the muscle oxygen, bro. You got to feed it there, baby. Come on. So Rob's one of the guys who likes to look at his muscle while he trains. Come on, bud. Nice, baby. Ready? All right, guys. This is the last set of that cross the chest bullshit. <laughs> I shouldn't call it bullshit because it's pretty badass. Um, I dropped it. I dropped the weight a little bit. Do as many reps as I can. Never, ever, ever am I concerned about weight anymore. Once in a while, I'll throw up heavy weight just to, hey, yeah, I did it. But when it comes to actually training, I don't give a fuck, man. Oh, man. All right, here we go. Right here, guys. Arms a rock. See it moving uh, on every rep. I just feel like I have a look of joy all over my face. Is that true? <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. Last set of this for for raw, baby. Come on. Come on, baby. Just nothing beats hard work, man. Come on. There he goes. He self spot himself again, man. I love that. I love it. I've been using, I've been doing four reps for about 20 years, guys, since I fucking started. All right, it works. Do it. You know, everybody thinks you can only do four reps with freaking, with a spot of her chest, man. Do it biceps, triceps, shoulders, man. Legs, anything. Anything. Come on, bud. Just keep that mind and muscle going. Squeeze, squeeze that chest right there, baby. Come on. Nice, dude. Good work. All right, man. You know what? What I was going to do is I was going to do the inclines, the dips, you know, the one arm chest presses. I'm just going to go in there. But, and then go to decline dumbbell presses, but you know, that ain't happening. Um, Rob and I both agreed that our chests are way too fucking. Way too fucking fucking pumped. So what we're gonna do is actually gonna stay on this chest press. We're just gonna do some standard chest press exercises. Um, I'm gonna start with the closest grip I can get. I'm gonna do like three sets maybe. And I'm gonna go as wide as I can get. And my presses are done. So just get the shit done. 
know, I got less than half the stack. You know, when I do it fresh, obviously I can do the whole stack. Like I said, I can do a thousand sets. I can work my way up. I can figure out which weight I need to get the number of reps that I feel like I've done enough, guys. It does not matter. Experiment with this, man. So what I mean by the closest grip I can get is this. All right, obviously I can't get any closer. So look at I'm not gripping the bar. All I'm doing is pushing it. Just push it. Put hands wide open. Push. Racing. It's a little light from so the next set. I'll go up a little bit. Come on, Come on Rob. Nice, dude. Nice. That's it. No need to grip the bar like a fucking death grip, dude. You know, when, when you keep your hands open like this too, man, your biceps are less involved. Believe it or not. There you go, but blow out, breathe in, blow out. Nice, dude. All right, guys. Last set was a little light. So I increased it by like 10 plates, 15 plates, whatever it is. Um, so I'm going to set my second working set. It's a little heavier, a little harder. If I can't do any, I'll, uh, I don't know, I'll edit this part of the video out.